welcome to click my project account. This video is all about explaining the project description or flow of the model and demo of the project online insurance. Let's start from the project description. The project we propose online insurance which you consider as an insurance management website to a particular company. This project is based on CMS techniques. The aim of this project is to change the content dynamically on online itself to provide a user interface application and to keep track of the policy details, customer details and staff details. The EVO aim can be established by creating a layer structural model and each model may have sub module. Our online insurance website has two user interface, admin model and user model. Admin is responsible for creating staff details, branch details, company details, policy details and also provide the user with the username and password. The user interface model is classified into five types CEO, manager, staff, agent, and the customer. User can log in into our site and can access the service offered by the admin. Let's start from the admin model. Admin can log in into our system and can access the service as follows. Admin can view their profile details, update their profile details, and change the password routinely for security reasons. Admin is responsible for creating company, staff, branch, agent details. Admin can perform update, delete and view operation if necessary on a board details. Admin can view the customer details and delete the customer details if, nece if necessary. Admin has a mail service and Skype service to communicate with CEO, branch manager and to with the staff, etc. As the data flow diagram for the admin is as shown below. As we have discussed, the user interface module is classified into five types CEO, manager, staff, agent, and the customer. Let's start from the CEO module. CEO can log in into our system and can access the service as follows. CEO can view their profile detail, update their profile detail, and change the password periodically for security reasons. CEO is responsible for creating new policy details and update the policy and delete the policy if necessary. CEO broadcasts the policy details to branch manager to mail service. CEO can view reports on policy employee performance and branch reports by monthly and yearly basis. CEO can use a mail service to communicate with the branch manager, staffs, or with the admin. The data flow diagram of the CEO is as shown below. The next module would be the branch manager module. Branch manager is responsible for adding new agent to their branches and can view, update and delete the agents. Branch manager can view the policy broadcast from the CEO and implement the policy within their branches. Manager can reports on the policy due, policy payment and customer details within their branches. Branch manager can view the customer feedback and send reply to the feedbacks. Branch manager can use mail service to communicate with the CEO, staff, and the agent. The data flow diagram for the manager is as shown below. The next module would be the staff module. Staff can log in into our system and can access the service as follows. They can view their own profile details, update their profile, and change the password routinely for security reasons. Staff can view the message from the manager regarding the policy details. Staff can view report about the policy handled by them. Staff can use mail service to communicate with the branch manager, customers or with the agent. The data flow diagram for the staff is as shown below. The next module would be the agent module. The agent module is same as the staff module as we have discussed before. The data flow diagram for the agent is as shown below. Next model will be the customer model. The customer can log in into our system and can access the service as follows. Customer can view their profile details, update their profile details and change password routinely for security reasons. Customer can view their policy due policy payment and due date of their policies. Customer can send feedback to the branch manager regarding any queries on the policies. Customer can use mail service to communicate with the branch manager and to the staffs or to the agent. This would be the data flow diagram for the customer model. The overall flowchart for this project is shown below. 
So far we have discussed the project description and the workflow of the model. Let's start from the demo of the project. In our project we have two views, front end view and back end view. The front end view contains the insurance details which can be viewed by the visitors or guests who are just visiting the insurance website. The content in the front end view are added by the admins and the CEO. The another view is the back end view. Which, contain, which provides services to the admin, CEO, staff, customer or to the agent. Let's start from the admin model. The username for admin is admin and the password is 123. By clicking on the login button, admin can login into our system and can access the service offered to him. The first page would be the home page which contains the profile details of the user who had logged in. By clicking on the update button, the admin can update their own profiles. The services offered to the admins are co company details, branch details, staff details, as in staff, agent details, and mail service. By clicking on the company details, uh, admin can add details to the company. By clicking on the view company details, admin can view the details which has been already added for the companies. By clicking on the delete company, admin can delete the details which has been created by him. By clicking on the logout button, admin can logout from our system and return to the home page. The next model is the CEO model. The username for CEO is 1001 and the password is 123. By clicking on the login button, the CEO can login into our system and can access the service offered to him. The first page would be the home page which contains the profile detail of the user who logged in. The services offered to the CEO are the policy menu, the broadcast menu, latest new menu and the our partners menu. By clicking on the policy menu, the CEO can add policies to the company. By clicking on the view policy, the CEO can view the policy which has been already been created by him. By clicking on the delete policy, the CEO can delete the policy which has been already created by him. Like that, the CEO can add details to the broadcast latest news and the our partner menus. By clicking on the logout button, the CEO can logout from our system and return to the home page. The next model is the branch manager model. The username for branch manager is 112 and the password is 123. By clicking on the login button, the branch manager can login into our system and can access the service offered to him. The services offered to the branch manager or agent menu, customer feedback menu, reports menu and mail service menu. And by clicking on the logout button, the branch manager can logout from our system and return to the home page. The next model is the branch manager model. The username for branch manager is 112 and the password is 123. By clicking on the login button, the branch manager can login into our system and can access the service offered to him. The services offered to the branch manager or agent menu, customer feedback menu, reports menu, and mail service menu. And by clicking on the logout button, the branch manager can log out from our system and return to the home page. The next model would be the staff model. The username for staff is 114 and the password is 123. By clicking on the login button, the staff can login into our system and can access the service offered to him. The services offered to the staff are enrollment details, customer details, and policy details, and mail service details. By clicking on the logout button, the staff can log out from our system and return to the home page. The next model is the agent model. The overflow of the agent model is same as the staff model. So let's see the customer model. The username for customer is 232 and the password is 123. By clicking on the login button, the customer can login into our system. The first page would be the profile details which contains the normal profile detail of the user who logged in. The services offered to the customers are feedback menu, policy details menu, inbox menu. By clicking on the policy detail menu, the customer can view their policies. And by clicking on the logout menu, the customer can log out from our system and return to the home page. Thank you for watching this video.